Hi guys, it's Ben here and it's day trip time again. This time I'm making a step up from London football. It's of course Liverpool versus Crystal Palace. Uh, my first Liverpool game of the season, the first home league game of the campaign. Uh, what an exciting day ahead. Uh, it's 7am here in London. Uh, obviously a lot earlier than I should normally need to leave, um, but for various reasons. So I'm, I'm in hospitality today. Um, don't hate me. It's not uh, something I've paid for. It's, uh, it's just something I, I was lucky enough to get for free today. So I um, need to get there quite early uh, for the free booze and food. So um, pretty excited for that. It's the first time I've ever been in hospitality in any sort of football match. So um, interested to see uh, how that goes. I'm going with Steve Hoare, who some of you might know from Twitter or, uh, or the Bib Theorist podcast back in the day or Ray really Liverpool. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get there around lunchtime for that. So my train is at 8.07am, I'm hoping. Obviously we're, we're, we're facing Palace, another London side, so a lot of people get in the train from Euston to Liverpool today. Um, you know, normally when it's just us playing at home anyway, uh, there's a big old, big old London contingent that travel up uh, on match day that will annoy some of you. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't offend you too much for people from London support Liverpool. Um, but yeah, so I've got a, I only booked my train last night as well. I hadn't even thought about travel and accommodation until last night when I uh, decided to finally book my train and hotel. So I've managed to do it relatively cheaply. Um, I mean, I say that. <laughs> I've done okay. Um, so yeah, I'm going to arrive in Liverpool uh, around quarter past ten, get to my hotel, drop my stuff off, get changed into my shirt and tie and then make my way to Anfield, meet Steve and then have a few beers and uh, watch the game. I'm very nervous for this one. I've just seen this one and that Sadio Mane might be out, uh, which completely changes my prediction. Uh, I had him down to score, they've to win quite comfortably. Uh, he's been our best player so far, so my confidence is, uh, is not all there now that I know he may not feature. Uh, but look, I'll speak to you soon. Let's have a great day. So I've arrived in Seaforth, which is where I'm staying tonight, just outside the city centre, uh, a couple of miles out. So uh, it's 11 a.m. Uh, obviously I can't check in yet, but I'm hoping they can let me change and uh, leave my bag there so I can make my way to Anfield. Uh, Going to be there very early, so uh, plenty of pints to be had before the game. Right, already the first problem of the day. There's nowhere for me to get changed in the hotel. Um, the guy wasn't very helpful. He wouldn't take my bag or anything. Uh, so I've gone to Home Bargain, see if there's a toilet in there. There wasn't. Just have to search for a supermarket with a toilet or a pub. Uh, fuck me. The guy in that hotel absolutely hates me. I've dropped my bag off. Good to go. On the way to Anfield now. Uh, he's going to downgrade my room later. I know it. He absolutely hates me. Uh, but yeah, on the way to Anfield we go. Up the Reds. The last night, in the place you put over in the sky. Someday you will find me. Pretty busy around here already, even though we're about two hours from kickoff. Uh, great to be back, great to be back around here. I'm not going to record too much of the actual game. Um, I'll be too into it, I'll be too uh, upset or too happy to be filming the game, but um, I'll do as much as I can. I'll show you the hospitality experience. Um, looking forward to this. Not the most exciting half of all time. Back in 
nil-nil, boring. Uh, very little footage to be got from that because it was so dull. Uh, Robertson was our best player. Um, other than that, a very little chat about slow tempo. Um, just glad to be at my point, really. I've uh, been looking forward to it since about 25 minutes. Hopefully second half, maybe bring Salah on. I think Firmino's been really poor on the left. Um, need to be better second half. to do that, they never had a chance after that, which is always pleasing and you know, I thought the defence would look solid today and got a clean sheet which was which was much needed. Right, he paired Solanke up with, uh, with Firmino and I was saying to you as he come on, I think he's going to take Firmino off, so for him to take Genie off and go almost 4-4-2, he obviously yeah. went for the win, so when you gamble, you make your own look, I think so. I think in the end we just about deserve to win. It's yeah. a nice one new win for Liverpool to kickstart our season really in the league. Wasn't a vintage display and look, I couldn't record much of that. Um, I was too into it. But I, I can't sit there and get my phone out and record the game. games. So I'm, I'm just too too nervous, too anxious. Uh, but look, we're around the same when this is so windy. But um, delighted with the win. It's now 11:30 p.m. I couldn't record today in the in the ground because a because you can't do it because it's Premier League and it's you know it's the uh, it's the way it is. It's the rules. And B because. I just couldn't, I, I, I'm, you know, it's, it's my team. I, I can't get my phone out and start recording when we're, you know, through on goal. I'm, I'm, I'm too entrenched in the game. Uh, so, you know, if you're looking for that sort of thing, I apologise. When we get back to non-league, I'll get back to doing that sort of thing. But uh, if you're a Liverpool fan, thanks for watching. Uh, hopefully you've seen my player ratings as well with Steve Hall. If you're not a Liverpool fan, thanks for watching, you know, even more so, because, you know, fair play to you for being interested, even though I'm not necessarily a fan of your club. Soccer Saturday coming soon. End of, end of September, we don't have a Soccer Saturday. Everyone, thank you very much. Please do subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook. It's been my say on every single one of those platforms. I'll see you soon. Up the fucking Reds.